up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We're going to learn Slow Ride by Foghat. Uh, anyway, if you haven't yet, I appreciate you subscribing here to the Marty Music YouTube channel, clicking the bell notification. It really does help me out. And then I've got a bunch of great resources in the links below. Check those out. All right, let's rock. All right, this original recording, the guitar is a little bit sharp. I'm in standard tuning. A lot of it revolves around this classic A chord. Sometimes A power chord. But you just, you know, want to get into that one finger kind of vibe. So the little intro before the main riff is, and, and also the rhythm, down, up, up, 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 down, up. My thumb's muting the low E too. Oh, beat, oh, beat. And that's the third fret A string, so. And then a little pickup on the third fret low E. to the main riff. And so what I'm doing with that is, I'm still doing that down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up. So then I'm playing a D power chord. So. So the next section, which was like the verse, I guess we could call it, it's A power chord. And then just a little piece of what I'm thinking of as an F sharp minor chord, but I'm just playing fourth fret D, second fret G. And that's when the bass is going, you know, doing a, a higher up part. And so the two voicings are the A and that little piece of F sharp. So you've got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Ba -ba -ba -ba. So the next section, A minor seven, which is just like an A minor with the ring finger off. So first fret on the B, second fret D. And then it, you could actually get away moving that up a whole step, but we have to add second fret G. So I'm playing this chord. It's like an inverted D major. So it's actually, you could also think of it as that, but then you're adding the third of the B. And there is, I do hear the high E in there. It's not as predominant, but so. Classic A. Next, it does the A power chord followed by that inverted D. Twice, then chug. Then again. And 
And so I'm just going right to the A minor pentatonic. Bum, 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 bum. So two times on the seven. Bum, bum, five, seven, and then two times on the five of the A. Back up to seven. And then I'm playing eight, five. All right, next we have some uh, funky little line. So between the uh, 10 and 8, and then, and this is the kind of A blues, but with some major third in there. Then between 9 and 7. And then I am doing six, between six and five. And kind of bending that. So you have the five on the B, five on the G, but you gotta bend that G up. Followed by... So I'm hitting the 7th fret D, 6 on the G, chromatically up. Then 10 on the B, over to 9 on the G. And then I'm going down pentatonic. 9, 7, 5 with a bend. Finally, you play that first part of it again. And a little tag there up in the upper register. Starts the same way. Uh, seven, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten on the B. Hop over to the ten on the high E. Ten, eight, ten, twelve, eight, ten on the B. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the lesson. Feel free to request stuff you'd like to see in the comments below. And while you're down there, once again, I appreciate you liking the video, subscribing to the channel, clicking the bell notification, and checking out the links below that are usually really helpful to you, and I think you should check them out. See ya!